want to go see where the baby pigs were born. Minnesotans start their state fair traditions early in life. Nice but none sooner than Ed Moseman. My mom was in the beer garden and she felt a little queasy. A pregnant woman in the beer garden? Well, duh. <laughs> it was 1954. And uh, boom, there I was. As a longtime guest of the State Fair campgrounds, you <laughs> might imagine Ed has told that story a time or two. Hey, you go, you're kidding me. I said, no, I'm not. He has the proof. This is my birth certificate. It says place of birth, Minnesota State Fairgrounds. I was born in the middle two windows. Ed's mom was moved from the beer garden to the fair superintendent's house, who happened to be Ed's grandpa. This is the house. A doctor was located in the campgrounds. He came over and helped with the delivery and uh, used his shoelace to tie my umbilical cord. The newspaper did little clippings of the doctor's story when he got back. When a big old doctor helps deliver a baby at fair. Born at the fair, but Ed's story starts before that. Yeah, Our mom and dad met here at the fairgrounds. I was probably conceived here, I don't know. <laughs> 2009 marks Ed's 56th fair. He hasn't missed one yet. Yeah, I'm serious about this. Need more proof? This is a big deal. Take a look at this. This is the water tower with fireworks going off behind. Ed Moseman, Fairborn. <laughs> Should we go arm in arm? And fair proud. Sure. Okay. Boyd Hooper, Carol Evan News at the State Fair.